Well, lace up those running shoes. This weekend, hundreds will make their way around Kapi'olani Park for the largest event of its kind in the state. It's this year's Honolulu AIDS Walk, and it's not too late to get involved. Joining us with more, with more details, is Melanie Moore of the Life Foundation. Good morning, Melanie. Hi, thanks Thank for you so having much for joining me. Us. So let's talk about the AIDS epidemic in Hawaii. You know, back in the 80s and 90s, people were really afraid. There was this fear. But what is it looking like right now? Um, well, you're right. Back in the 80s, it was a lot different. And that's when Life Foundation was founded. We were one of the first AIDS organizations in the country, actually. Um, it's changed a lot since then with the advent of AIDS medications. We see our patients living longer. We now have HIV testing with results in 15 minutes. And today, we estimate there's about 3,000 people in Hawaii living with HIV and AIDS. Let's talk about those medications. I mean, because they work so well, having HIV is no longer a death sentence. So do you think that's affected the awareness of getting infected by HIV? You know, it definitely does because our patients are living so much longer. You know, I know people have been living 20, 30 years with the disease. It doesn't have the emotional urgency it once did when we heard about so many deaths happening. Um, however, it's still an issue. We see it rising in Asian and Pacific Islander populations here in Hawaii. Um, half of new infections occur in people under the age of 25. And just last year, Life Foundation lost 17 of our clients. Wow. And so the Life Foundation is getting ready for a really fabulous walk of Kapi'olani Park. That's what is right. it going to be like on Sunday? That's going to be a fun weekend. We are expecting about 6,000 people to come down. Uh, we're hoping to raise uh, about $250,000 to support our work. So we need everyone's help to do this. It's a really fun event. We've got amazing entertainment, prizes. It's an easy 5K around Kapiolani Park. And uh, there's entertainment all along the route, and we encourage everyone to come down. What types of programs will the money be going toward in the future? So uh, Life Foundation works with more than uh, 700 people living with HIV right here in Oahu, and also we offer free HIV testing and education to the community. So all the money raised stays right here on Oahu. Oh, well, fantastic. Melanie Moore from the Life Foundation, thank you so much for joining thank us. Thank you. And are you going to be walking or running yourself? I will actually be running the registration tent, <laughs> so I'll be running around like a crazy person. But all right. it's not too late to sign up. Everyone should just head on down that day. Well, it's all for a great cause. Thank it you, is. Melanie. Thank you. And to see this interview again or to watch any of the segments on our morning news, you can check out this morning on KITV.com. It is 647. Thanks for joining us.